Who wants to be happy Adeline? Oh, I can take Adeline. H Happeline. But we... Actually, Dewey's funny. Yeah, Dewey is funny. So is DDD. Uh, I can be on the Natural line. conclusion. <laughs> go all the way to the, um... No, 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 go to DDD. Yeah, we sure can. You huh? What the fuck? <laughs> I'm built different! Wait, hold on, let me try something real quick. The lick? Is the this an enemy? Yes, yeah, don't kill the... No. <laughs> I refuse. Only, only I get to show off my cool oh, yeah, moves. I forgot you're fueled in, in only by violence because you're some fucking feral animal. Yeah, basically. I mean, I, I'm a Dong and Rampa fan. What did you say? I, mean, I don't know. I expected some decency. Well, you you expect no, a lot out of things. Here's the thing: we're Dong and Rampa friends, but we're not toxic. Oh yeah, we are. We are the funny Dong and Rampa. We are funny Dong and Rampa fans. Yes. Implying there they're are funny Danganronpa fans. Yeah, they, yeah, no, no, there are funny Danganronpa fans. fans. It is just me and Seth. No, no, there are other funny Danganronpa fans, but in terms of the ones in this room, we are the funny Danganronpa fans. Now, if only Twitter would acknowledge we exist. If only Twitter would stop. Twitter is, was a mistake. Twitter is a cesspool of only bad. No, Twitter wasn't a mistake. Allowing people to get on it was. Well, that's the whole fucking S point S of Twitter, then, you dipshit. So Twitter is just a barren wasteland? Honestly, that would be a lot better than the Twitter we have today. Anyways, you guys ready to have a four-way 69? Oh god! Well, no, I'm getting your ass, Donald. Not the soul. <laughs> no, and then it. Uh huh. Oh look god, Adeline is. Oh, in look at look at stomach. that tongue! It, oh my god, you're already pressing jump. Come on, you don't need to grieve. No, I got this. I'll control. I'll control. It's a 47-61. Stop. Did you just multiply 69 by four? I have my phone next to me, I use the calculator. Oh. Well, see, Dad? Mental math, mental math is hard. No, no, it's Wait, not. Wait, what, what number did you say? 69 squared. Yeah, which is what? 4761, I used the calculator. Oh, I thought, I, for a second I thought you were trying to do 69 times 4, and I was like, that is not right. Well, no, it's 69 squared is wrong, it's 69 to the 4th. Right. No? Yeah. Oh, wait, that's because it's 469. It's 4 way. Yeah, it's, it's a... Um, wait, let me, let's do this and then I'll calculate it. We're putting, we're actually doing this. Uh, it's actual yep. math. Yeah, so we're all, we're all taking out our calculators. This is now a race. 69 to the power of Yo, we are a winner. Oh, wow, we all missed the goal game. We're all fucking stupid. <laughs> Not you. Um, it's 22,667,121. I mean, yeah, but 4-way 69 sounds a lot easier. So, alright, repeat after me. If you want to be funny, just say, water levels suck, am I right? Water levels suck. Am I right? You, you gotta add the am I right. Water levels right. suck, am I right? Hey, And then you go, and then, alright. Alright, cool. Lesson one. Lesson two. Then you go, what's the deal with airplane food? Umbrella. <laughs> Stop! We really don't have any commentary for the water level. It's, it's, it's not no. even sad. It's not sad. It's just... It it's just, a water level. Yeah, what the fuck did you expect? There is no such thing as original commentary for water level. It's just water level bad. Yep. The only time you get original commentary for a water level is when you're not talking about the water level. Yeah, let's not talk about the oh, water yeah, level. Oh yeah, you're right. Um, everybody's, um, what is everybody's favorite milk? What the fuck, Richard? I would game. like to play the video game. Now that Mini Lad has been cancelled for being a fucking bad person... Wait, who? Uh, Seth, can you make, um, can I play the video game, please, Lord, your catchphrase? Just steal it? Yes. I, I, I would like to steal that, because... <laughs> I don't know who you're talking about. It, it sucks, because I actually liked Mini Lad before he got cancelled. Why did he cancel? He... He just... He fucked with uh, chatting up with children. Oh, I love it. I love fucking with children, bro. It's my favorite way to get cancelled. Even though, why is it even called cancel? He totally deserved it. True? Well, yeah. It is it that- you know hard, Do you know how easy it is to not have sex with children? Exactly! It's so easy to not diddle children. The it's so easy, I can do it in my sleep. Tell that to Haiji Toa. Well, what do you mean, tell- Just don't fuck kids! That was a Dong and Rampa reference, and we were the only ones who got that, who were sitting in this room right now, but at the same time, yes, don't diddle kids! It's not that hard! <laughs> the friend plank. I really like this the animation. friend plank! You better not! You fucking asshole! <laughs> Which one of you- You know what, I, I, I'm taking my hands off the controller. It's in God's <laughs> hands now, whether or not these, these guys want to just cause problems, make this video longer. Alright, Meta Knight, fight me yourself, you fucking cunt! Oh. 
So how's the weather today? Pretty good? Yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, I'd say the weather is nice. It's very uh, dark out here with the uh, ominous cloudy skies in the cliffs. Are you, yeah, there he goes. All right, time to get my cardio. Ah! He kicks the sword! Uh, think about Spark is that... Yeah, what were you saying? The thing about Spark is that instead of having to charge it in the game, you have to charge it IRL. You are getting the uh, maximum capacity jungle today. You guys could give some commentary. No, I'll take the kill instead. Well, we got Meta Knight and Dark Meta Knight and a whip guy. It's my house key. It's my house. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my house. Alright, I'm MTV. Welcome to my crib. Over 400 fucking hours later, and i finally done it. Super John Old K-World is real. Exploring can lead to some hidden secrets, like becoming just fucking invincible. Alright, uh, God fears me. Like, come on, why do you think I- why do you think I have anxiety? If I didn't have anxiety, God would have been dead. Like, well, I would have killed him directly. Whatever. Once you get the key, I'm not talking about that one. I had an idea, like, way back to use my, like, entire 100 uploads that I could possibly have for Super Mario Maker 2 and make an entire semi-comprehensive Super John Old Maker, like, Odyssey, a whole like, 100 stage long world, alright? With bonus levels, uh, 9 normal world- well, 10 worlds, technically. World 10 would be the bonus level. But I decided to scrap it because I do have a life, and- well, probably not, but I do want to keep my sanity. So it wasn't until I showed the super world off to my friends that I noticed this chimney thing looks very phallic. Yeah, I've definitely made a few oversights in this world. Fuck. <laughs> well, you know- you know what? You know what? Show show must go on. I'm dead. Getting this key coin is a little bit uh strange, but what you have to do is go from downtown. So initially, I wanted to have a little thing where the spike ball comes down, and then you have to guide that spike ball all the way into a little crevice here. But then I ground pounded on this little thing, and the spike ball just jumped up, and I I discovered that completely on accident, and I found it very funny. So I had uh. So I had the player use it for a key coin. So when I uploaded Subterranean Smashing, I made the description for this level asterisk thwomp noise asterisk. And you're supposed to interpret that as Rrrr. In the original draft of Super John Four, Larry was actually the first boss of this game, and Lemmy was boss number six. And the reason I started the level over is because I got to world six, I made the boss fight for Lemmy, and it was it was still Lemmy's bouncy battalion, and then I realized, wow, this is easy. So I just redid the whole world over. Nothing, no big deal, no cost to my mental psyche at all. <laughs> the whole conception of totem trails was, hey, the semi-solid platform kind of looks like a totem pole, and then. The rest is history. God fucking damn it. One day I was brainstorming for Super Donald World and thought to myself, what if I made a level based on every single gizmo and enemy in Super Mario Maker 2? And then I immediately stopped myself and thought, am I fucking crazy? All right, you see all these fishies there? A pipe, a wall, you know what it's time for. Embarrassment. No, silly, it's everyone's favorite theme, the water level. So one day, I was recording Kirby Star Allies with the gang, and the fool played by Super Mario Maker World, and when he got here, the first thing he did, well, was, well, that, get fucking bored. In one of the previous drafts of Super John Old World, the forest level, fucking Christ! In one of the original drafts of Super John Old World, the forest world was actually unbeatable. In one of the original drafts of Super John Old World, the forest level was originally themed around the four seasons. You had a spring level, a summer level, an autumn level, and the winter level. And then you had a death. You give your own levels an inch and suddenly they take your life from you. Aspiring Mario Maker 2 Super World Makers, if you're wondering how I had the little rain effect at the top, I put a whole layer of falling icicles and if you go up high enough, 
you have a little bit of a problem. Sometimes your aesthetic has its consequences. One thing you can do with the Super Mario Bros. 2 power-up that I demonstrated a little bit earlier. Whoop. Snowball fight. Damn. Oh no. <laughs> I saw it all go wrong right there. I'm gonna pick the Goomba. Cause man, look at this. He's just standing there menacingly. Oh, you're approaching me? Stained Glass Skyway was basically a result of me asking the question, what the fuck should I use these semi-solids for? Hey yo, is this? It's time to hone in the power. My skills. Bring them all to me. Collect all seven chaos brain cells and collect them all become Super Donald. No, I'd say this is my hair. Or what about this one? No, I'd say this is my hair. The man- I'm not fucking with the man bun. How about this? This is actually kind of close. How about this one? It looks like it's a little fuckboy. Time to spend the next 10 minutes of this recording session typing in access keys. Oh! Oh, receipt from popular! Oh, we've changed the game! I'm never playing this video game ever again. I hope you realize. I am unlocking the secret potential to this game. The access codes are mine. Oh, there he is, fellas. Shh. There's an access key exchange on a forum? Oh my god, where do I sign up? It's Sherry Grandma Blobfish. Fits like a glove. I'm descending. It's a madness. This is the greatest fucking moment of my life. Hold on. Look at that! <laughs> there it is! This! This is the one. <laughs> $19 Fortnite card! I don't like how real red looks. In terms of Metopia content, this is huge. Welcome to Greenhorn. <laughs> it's going about as great as I expected it. Monsters with people's faces. Ah ha ha, you gotta be kidding me. Great horns of peace, so play. Come on, JFK, you've been on my party before. What, you don't recognize me with my new anime protagonist glow up? Oh, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> what the hell? Huh? Uh-oh, the Dark Lord's coming! Uh, hey, what's that? What? Where? Oh! Oh no, the Dark Lord's coming! Oh no! Not the Dark Lord! The tall vampire lady from Resident Evil! Whatever will I do? Oh god, I hope he doesn't stomp on me. 30 minutes have passed! This is the first time we're gonna get gameplay! Whee! <laughs> I can't. I, I I have to tap out. I I, I didn't even. I, I, it's the, it's like not even the second battle yet, and I'm tapping out of this game. Oh, a party member. Oh, I wonder who that could be. Wait, who is this exactly? Wait, the baby. Let's go. Here comes the integral question. Do we want to give him a wig? I think that answers our question. No. <gasps> Another party member. I take it back. Please go back home. Oh, crewmate joined our party. Let's hope he's not imposter. Ha 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 ha. So, I have an idea. When the crewmate is fabulous. <laughs> there he is. Tingle. No, not our boy. <laughs> There he is, Rocky Tingle. This game could honestly cost both of my legs, and I'd, I'd still say it was worth it. Tingle is safe. Oh, God! Oh, his eyes under there! Oh, no! Oh, no! I'm really happy I get to customize my own horse, because, fun fact, I, ha I have a pet. Uh, well, it's not really a horse, it's a llama, uh, but she's kind of a little bit different from other horses. See. Um, what my pet llama does is she kind of- My horse's name is Cacophony. Well, give me that, uh, yo-yo. I think we should just all roll in the yo-yo. No, 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 that's the plan. No, I want- I want that back. Well, that's a damn shame. Oh. Well, you can be Ice Yo-Yo. You can be Edgy. Is that what you want? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Alright. 
Woohoo! Alright. Send me. We are the sick trick boyos! Let's go! We're here to style on these motherfuckers. Well, we can plan and con go. Hey! Yeah. I'll kill you. I'll rip you to pieces. Draw my avatar as a cat boy and put it on the screen. You won't. I I will. That'll be the thumbnail. Anyways, I'll rip you to pieces. Without a, <laughs> there will there will not be an atom of your body left. I'll destroy you, annihilate you. You are nothing. Speaking of which, so I got a haircut the other day, right? Um, and by the other day, I literally mean the day we recorded those first two episodes of this playthrough. I got a haircut, right? Well, I have never gotten a haircut that I can genuinely that I can genuinely say looked good day one. So I'm wearing a hat right now because my hair, you know, very volatile. With this haircut, you know, I look really, really good, or I look like Megan Rapinoe. You may know her from the U.S. Women's Soccer Team. She's the one who went to Congress to get the wage gap. Now, uh, you know. As an 18-year-old boy, I feel like looking like a 30-year-old woman, not now, necessarily the best move. So anyways, like, balls deep in this nut, right? It's my joke. I know, it's it's very funny. It, does it have, like, an ending? Does it have an ending, or is that the punchline? No, so my theater teacher went to, like, a yeah. Catholic college in, like, Pittsburgh or Philadelphia or something like that. I and feel so like I know the end of He was, like, good friends with, like, a super religious person, right? And so he thought it'd be really funny to walk, and he thought they were in the lo that this person was in the laundry room. So he thought it'd be really funny to say really loudly. Totally just when he goes. He thought like, it'd be really funny to say super loudly. So I'm balls deep in this nun, right? <laughs> nice. Or like something like that. That uh, that's a that's like a about committing game. a horrific crime against the nun. That's a powerful. But here and it'd be like really funny. But he's like there were like a bunch of other people in there, and she wasn't there. So it was just like a whole thing. That's powerful. Do any of you guys recommend Boku no Piku? No. Isn't Avatar The Last Airbender like borderline in anime? It's not. I haven't watched Avatar The Last Airbender. I've watched Avatar with the blue people. Oh, that movie is garbage. <laughs> that movie's the highest grossing movie globally of all time. Yeah, it is. Well, Endgame beat it out. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. No, Endgame is the highest grossing film from a franchise. Avatar is the highest grossing solo. Why? Because this is James Cameron and he's a goat. Oh. Name one character from Avatar with the blue people. A uh, blue person. Exactly. Better the game, better the part. I'm literally garbage. I'm literally zero PR. I'm literally, literally on an airplane. airplane. God damn it! I lose my ability every time I touch an object. So for those of you who didn't understand what I just said about being on an airplane, there was a video about uh, some guy playing Smash Ultimate on airplane Wi-Fi. And it's not like you know, like, oh, he has McDonald's Wi-Fi. No, no, no. He's literally on an airplane using the airplane's Wi-Fi to play Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Yup, he paid extra for high speed, and he just demolishes a fool. Bear in mind, he does demolish a fool as Zelda, but I think him being on an actual airplane cancels it out. Alright, time for Flamberge to die. Aw, oh, it's my voice, let's go. Flam Flamberge is incredible. The fool, what new Furby abilities do you That's a great question. Is it weird if I think Flamberge sounds like a valley girl? You say Flamberge sounds like a valley girl, you say. Well then. John, you know, <laughs> Shink. <laughs> Shink, he, he says as he pushes up his uh, non-existent anime glasses. <clears throat> it's fine. Hey, Shink. you! This is the little pink thing! <laughs> oh my god. Yes, you! I have a burning question for you! You're the one who was so rude to sweet friend! Just go on to Don't you dare try to deny it! Fiend Gower, I swear if you learn a single blue hair on her perfect head, you'll burn for it. Damn blasted, I will never ever forgive you. Now you must face flammers. That's me. For what you done, I'll scorch you to such a degree that that even tasty toasty marshmallows will seem like ice cubes compared to you. I don't know when the hell she turned into a wrestling announcer, but you know what? <laughs> Such is life. Um, what's what's the what's a good um ability that I like to see? Yeah, Sam's a good one. Sam would be Maybe, cool. Maybe uh, S Sam would be cool. Um, I mean, funny gun Kirby. <laughs> oh ha ha! Cue the deleted funny. scene. I mean, because well, well, because Kirby abilities are either based on like an element in real life or like something that one can wield. Like, I mean, so I'm trying to think of like elements in real life. No, there are things. There are other things based on it, like circus, for example. Jobs, Jobs. beetle, Jobs. animals, accountant Kirby. 
Kirby does his taxes deluxe. <laughs> <laughs> Come back to Luxembourg, sending out an army of 80 people and coming back with 80 more because they made a friend. <laughs> they made a friend. Aww, how wholesome. Hot take. The political compass is basically... How do I put this? I put, I'm gonna put this in an analogy. Boys is to the political compass as girls is to astrology. Yes. Uh, Francesca's Morty. Because she's timid. Flamber just two seconds away from being Hulk Hogan. <laughs> You're gonna have a lot of splicing to do, but I'm gonna do something really funny. Alright. No. Continue. I don't know, come on. Hit the A button. The fool! Come on, hit the A button. Actual, it's funny. Do a do an actual voice. This is gonna be a pain in the ass for me to edit. What did I come back to? Um, it, a nightmare. So how about the weather today? It's pretty good, right? Finally done. It's done. Oh my god, never do that again. I'll do an actual voice next time. Thank Christ. Maybe. What do you mean, maybe? I'm so fucking good at this game. That baseball cap on you look kind of like the baby. Let's go! No, no, no. no. Put your phone no. down. Fine. <laughs>